Oh my god, I'm alive. Ah. Ah, I played that sloppy. You can win that as real. Come on, auto queue. No, bye. Yesterday was, um, yeah. We're not gonna talk about yesterday. I'm getting better at Zed, so I'll actually be playing a lot more Zed. Uh, my Zoe is improving. I don't know if it's still in the ranked uh, setting though, but I might play a couple of Zoe games. Katarina is good again, so <coughs> I'm planning to play a lot more Cat using this room page. So yeah, right now those are the champions that I'm looking at. I'm looking at Zed, I'm looking at Cat, and then I'm probably Renekton mid and Syndra for uh, matchups that I'm not comfortable on. Okay, so it looks like we're going to be being ADC for the first game. <coughs> Kaisa is open, so we have Nautilus. Oh wait, we have no. First game on, so I'm not expecting my mechanics to be completely up there, but we're gonna have to see. I might not even need good mechanics. I might be fine just as is. Okay. Oh, I didn't turn off the AC. I was wondering why it was so chilly here still. My hands are getting pretty cold because they see. Let's go. Such a big fight. We have the cringe um, champion on our team, Alawi. Oh god, Alawi is smacking down the... Uh... I want to have enough money to get my collector on uh, first recall, if possible. I could have played it a bit faster and I would have died. I don't know, I went in early because I thought I had my ultimate up. <laughs> but also to be fair, my fingers are really cold. What the fuck just happened? Um, okay. Yeah, all right. I, w I was not paying attention for like a second. Okay, you don't know me. <laughs> All right, so Akali just gets <laughs> four kills. Oh my God, I'm alive. Oh my god. Yo, Nautilus, beat him up. Yo, Nautilus. Oh no, so close. No, it's so close. My Nautilus almost dicked on the fucking blitz. God damn, bro. The, the, that's a banger first game. Holy hell. I can move. They 
probably have it worded though. Yeah. <laughs> Ari's just going to ult away. Yeah, so my top laner and my mid laner are just challenger, I guess. Let's just flash. No, my cannon. Oh, I got it. Hey, that's how we fucking go. Okay, nice. Good pick. sucks i misplayed the kali is here now too i'm keeping an eye on the blitzcrank definitely because he's trying to hook me nice you just take it You know, I could get used to my uh, my games <laughs> going like that today. That was a nice change of pace. I think League did not expect that game neither because uh, it's... <laughs> um, hello, Riot? You guys are enjoying this video. If you're watching on YouTube, you're having a good day. And if you're liking it so far, I post a lot of this type of content on my channel every Wednesday and every Friday. I try to be consistent. I don't always make it to these streams but i usually make it to the video uploads so if you guys like this content chances are you're gonna like everything on my channel so don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you do by the way i had some people ask me why i no longer have a camera and i don't know if i've answered this in one of my videos the app i used to use camo studios now costs money for some reason for me and if i used a free version my camera often bugs out so that explains why i'm just gonna play regular vein or regular katarina matchup you know getting as much cs as possible but the most important part is experience here she wins early nice fast track can get my items to fast track and start getting going extremely entertaining video to watch or stream to watch right now <laughs> There's just not a whole lot that I can do right now. Okay, I can try now. Nice. I don't want to steal too much of the CS. I ex that's weird. I expected them to go on Drake there. Uh, I feel like I'm going to have to build very... Def like, I'm not build. I'm going to have to play this very slow. <laughs> just because of the, the pick that she did. So she's now really hard to trade with. I'm going to get one more auto here. Yeah. Yeah, trading with her is going to be nigh impossible. I'm gonna have to keep looking for those rooms outside of uh, mid lane. <laughs> I am dead. Because she has lethal tempo, but I do get harvester. 
extra like I, I was dead there regardless if i would run earlier she would just chase me down because she ulted and her passive gives her a shit ton of movement speed there so i was dead there regardless i just wanted to make sure to at least get something that's worth it because i won't be able to get a cs lead on her early i'll have to do that when side laning but one thing i can do is stack my dark harvest up as much as possible in the early so that hopefully later on i'm gonna be able to i'm gonna miss that cannon sadly but hopefully in the later game, I can actually do a lot more damage in the team fights. And I'm not actually CSing that poorly. It's just she has a lead because she's ranged, right? Thank you. Ah. I played that sloppy. You can win that as real. Come on, auto Q. No, bye. You still had burial barrier up. God damn it. I also played that very shit. I <laughs> gotta gotta like admit that I played that very poorly. <laughs> I could have played that a lot better. <coughs> but again, I got two more dark harvest stacks, and I even got two kills from that. So honestly, not too bad. I need a hundred gold for my storm surge. This is gonna be another fight. Nice. There you go, Ezreal. There you go. That's what a little bit of good placed aggression can do for you. Diego's flaming me about something that he doesn't understand and it actually is wrong about. Because I didn't miss any CS. I wonder if she. Oh, shit. Okay. Again, I lost barely nothing from that one. Oh, the vision. The fucking vision, man. God damn it. I hate that so much. That's so annoying. Because I could have killed that so fucking easily. If there was just a ward in the bush. That's just you being dumb, Vayne. That's just literally you being stupid. Like, I'm still a Katarina. Nice. Maybe. Ah, you could have just autoed. Yeah, so many people make that mistake when uh, playing big or when you become a ranged champion. And that ranged champion has a high channel time on the ability. Oftentimes, it's just a lot more... What? Where the fuck did he go? Uh, okay, well played there, I guess. I literally don't even know where he went. He just disappeared, bro. The fuck? Yeah, I think I'm fine just going for Lich Bane here. Honestly. I want them to push this in. I don't think he realizes how much damage I do. Oh, wait. Yeah. Yeah. They don't respect my power, man. Like, I've got 13 harvest stacks. And I almost have three items plus boots. Clear that wave. Make sure they need to push that before contesting Drake or even thinking about contesting it. No, hope that this isn't warded. Might be able to do some, uh, some spooky... Spooky woogie. Or they just don't push at all. That turned mirror's bot said. I might get altered by Caitlyn, so I'm just gonna move away from the vision. I'm gonna be working towards getting my Lich Bane here, and then we probably can just start to 5v5 and roll them. No need, I guess. My team's goaded. I'm deliberately staying out of vision here. Never mind, I was on vision that entire time. 
<laughs> they just didn't do anything about it. We could get Baron here, yeah. And now I'm really strong. Like, they have to actually be careful. When did I get trapped? Oh, she hit me with her E. Okay, my bad. I didn't see that. Ezreal still dies. <coughs> we get a tower for that and probably inhibits her. Let's keep going. Yeah, I, I really need to turn off the AC after this. My hands are so cold, man. <laughs> Yo, yeah. Kick her ass. What the fuck is Yorick, though? Where did that damage even come from, bro? What the fuck? Nah, no, okay, he does die, but he nearly got inhibitor. Wake up here soon. Might be able to get ready for it. They might face check this. Actually, this push is more likely to get face checked. Like, as they walk down to Dragon, since I'm strong enough, I can potentially assassinate one or two of them. Put a control ward here in case it's Kha'Zix going invisible. But no, but it looks of things, they're just check. They're just. Yeah. They're just in their base. You weren't the only one with teammates there, bro. I simply baited you. I'm a master baiter. <laughs> Let's get this, actually. So how is everybody doing in chat? I see I've got seven people currently watching. How is everybody doing? That was just... <laughs> that was just an E. I'm sorry, man. You. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm trying to play this very carefully here. <coughs> I think we're better off just recalling and grabbing this. I don't know if I'm the only one that has this particular issue, but like lately I've been playing a lot of my other accounts because I've been playing with friends and all of my lower, you know, played accounts are unironically getting higher MMR than my main. And I'm also noticing that I lose a lot more on my main. I don't know why you run that way. I can ult you when you're invisible too, dude. I'm just trying to be careful here. And GG's. <laughs> nice. I think Yorick was just autoing the Nexus there at the last bit. These are some good games though, today. I don't know, today I'm not gonna spoil or not spoil. I'm not gonna like start talking about stuff going well because I know the gods are, are fucking listening and they're gonna be like, let me just smite you down. But yeah, I'm, shit's going well. So let's just keep going. But yeah, I'm gonna be buying uh, a camera pretty soon. Uh, I don't know when, because the camera that, I'm, that I wanna buy is pretty expensive. I can actually show you the one that I want. This is the camera that I wanna get. But right now, I don't have too much yet. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we're gonna just scroll that back there. Go back to the lead client. And that, that's the camera that I want to get. So it's Fizz that I'm against. I don't really like this matchup. It's very unplayable for Katarina. But luckily, they do have lanes that I can roam to very easily. We have a Warwick and they have a Zyra Caitlyn on the bot lane. We have a Zyra Caitlyn on the bot lane so they can line up when I roam down there. Top lane is likely not going to be roamed to ever in this game. You're not running bone plating, so I don't have to actually strip it off of you. You're not punishing me for all this CS. That's why, because you started E. I see. I guess I could poke you then. You're not running a second wind or anything else like that. So I'm just going to go ahead and just play very aggressive early on. I don't have electrocute, so going in there for a short trade would be suicide. Because when I play Katarina, I typically try to keep my health up as high as possible before level 3. You know, pretty normal Katarina stuff. He didn't actually punish me for uh, taking that clean little dodge on that. Orvik is completely dicking down the Diana. Oh, uh, you're just dead. Yeah. Rough. <clears throat> Not much I can do there if you go that deep so early on. It's just really hard for me to do anything on that. Just roam with me, bro. Please, it's a free kill. Okay, so he's already getting mad at it. Uh, if he keeps being toxic, by the way, I will just eventually mute him. Because I'm not in a mood to, uh, to get bitched at by random people. And I'm not playing to get to keep my team happy. I'm playing to win the game. So with that cleared out, I'm, I'm going to get my Sork Shoes first item this game, for sure. 
We can almost get a harvest off of him. There we go. It's harvest. He's probably going to recall off that, but it's fine. He has no potions. He is running Ignite, so he doesn't have TP. So we're going to go with the same build as previous games. The Storm Surge first into Shadow Flame into Lich Bane. Probably the Zonias then. Or I might even go Bear, uh, Banshees here. Because they do have a lot more AP this game. And I'm out. Let's fucking go. We can if you wanna. They don't know I'm here. Yeah, we don't fight that. Okay. I guess we can if they int. I wonder how many times he's gonna try and do that this game and just watch me do exactly the same thing every time. that shutdown i'm not giving that to you warwick because if i go bot lane here since my adc is mid for some reason i'm gonna be able to get shadow flame here mm. three people and i guess that's warded <laughs> like any yeah hopefully warwick can do stuff here gonna be hard as fuck to win this if they don't start playing correctly oh you trolled me yeah hey when you group once Keep chasing. doomed because of these three uh, champions and those are sadly champions that i really can't do too much against if i'm dark harvest katarina so this game we're likely going to be zed against ari which is a fine matchup same level one level two as katarina and then level three before i start to poker and kill her or maybe who knows maybe she eats a couple early cues you know you never know I'm going to play the lane very carefully. I'm just going to poke the Ari out, see how many of uh, my poke that she takes. And if she's low enough at level six, I kill her. I'm about to take a lot of minion damage. That's why I backed off there. I play as if I don't know Jarvan is coming. I know Jarvan was full health. Silence. 
Not sure that the ignite was needed, but um, got level six here. She uses teleport to come back to lane. We get the first dragon. That's good. Yeah, it sucks. I die. Yeah. Fiora too broken, bro. Okay. Ah, decent at least. I got a kill. I pick up Cyclo Sword and I get boots here. I know Ari is in there. Good job, Miss Fortune. Great job for like moving up so slow. I imagine she still killed me there somehow. Just imagine that, right? For a second. Yeah. Why you didn't... You can't play versus her. Okay. That's just gonna be muted. If you respond like that after I say something like that, and you're just muted, bro. I want a dot. Uh, I guess it's a good thing that I got out. Ari is bot lane, got the funny item, you know, the, the very balanced item on Ari, because having six dashes on a low cooldown is, is fair and intuitive gameplay on the way here. Are you shitting me? No, I still get you. Oh, wow. Awesome. Great. I'm gonna have to mute all of them, I think. All of them are gonna be bitching at me pretty soon. Only the Fiora and the Jarvan are really doing well. Ari is doing okay-ish. Even in comparison to like her team, she's not doing that well. That's good. Ari's top side. enough damage to kill her to kill him probably senna heal
Misfortune keeps dying solo now. If she keeps doing this, she will eventually die or lose the, us the game. Just a Fiora is just going to keep pushing. Why did they do that? Like, was there any need for inting that? Senna. We need to fight this. Like, I don't want to, but we need to. Honestly, yeah. I don't think this is winnable. Not with a team like this. Thank you for not stealing that. It's very helpful, actually. Okay, so we got turret. That's good. At least something good. Um, is she alive? Oh. Yeah, if you're as too fat, bro. Oh, they're inting. Just a hard game, bro. Useless jungler, useless top laner. It's hard. Oops, I'm also really behind. I'm slowly getting back, but really hard to deal with these these three. Nocturne is just inting, bro. This Nocturne is consistently solo dying for no reason. Keeps stealing my CS as well, so I'm just not able to get items. Epic, bro. Really dumb. Yeah. GG. Hard to do literally anything with these people, bro. I don't do any damage because I'm really far behind. So yeah. Guys are just inting. Running it for fun. In games like those, it's just really hard to know what to do. Ari bought Zonia, so she was really hard to fight anyways. I feel like if I want to play Zed in this elo, I have to go Bruiser Zed like 90% of the games. Which is really weird for me because I'm not used to playing that play so. Autism. 
Oh, it doesn't be like, oh god, I just realized that fucking comp I'm against. So my thought process behind this is simply that I'm gonna go Eclipse into Axiom, so I have my ultimate a lot, and then we go Sunderer. The Conqueror should give me a lot of power in auto attack fights. My initial combo should get me to almost uh, max out my Conqueror stacks, and then just another auto and an E in team fights, and I should have max... Uh, Conquer. And from that point on, I'm going to be very strong. <clears throat> That's the, the game plan here. So. Okay. So with Conquer, that's actually a good trade for me. Because she had to proc a potion and we still have ours. Which is very big here. Okay. One more like that and we, and we can kill her. She has a biscuit. Um, oh my... Oh no. I'm so sorry, Alistair. I'm so sorry. Alistair died there because of me. Because I missed the initial Q. I got the kill. So, you know, yay. But it just sucks that my support died for it. He didn't need to. I need to actually get my uh, Discord open on my second player. There we go. That's rude, Syndra. I was on my second monitor, not looking. There we go. That's the power roughly shown of Conqueror uh, Z. And I could have kept going. If she walks up, she dies here, actually. Okay. I don't care though I use my flash like that. I just want to make sure that she can't get away. So I want to get my items here. I'm alive! Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. I'm not sure if you can tell from my reaction or not, but I didn't expect to be live there. You know, I expected to be dead. <laughs> I can kill her here, actually. Very close. Very close fights here. I want to recall here, but I first want to shove out the wave so she actually misses out CS. That's a cannon that she's missing. That's rough. When she walks up, she loses a bit of her health here. No. And a second time. So we have enough CDR for that now. Now if she does that again, I can just walk up and kill her. I'm not forcing anything because I don't need to. Got the wave exactly where I want it to be. Rocking Eclipse nice and easily. Diego is here. <coughs> Likely bot said, I would guess. Okay, she's getting her uh, cues on the floor for an ult. I'm just gonna wait out my uh, my ult cooldown. No real need to roam to anywhere right now. Thank you. Misplayed a little bit. That's fine. We get platings here. Still don't have a full item. Basically saying that in 40 seconds, if you're still in lane, you'll die. I don't need to recall because I've got Eclipse keeping me up and my Doran Ring uh, lifesteal helping me out. Trying to bait her into going in on me here. 
Even if I play it right, her ultimate even goes through after her death. So if I kill her and she gets her ultimate off before I kill her, her ultimate will still kill me if I'm low enough. That's why Syndra is another one of those champions that I recommended uh, when I... Back when I still gave coaching, Syndra was one of those champions that I recommended people to learn. Oh no, wait, really? Who died? Oh, they got volley still. Damn it. You know what I'm noticing? For the past like few games, I'm slowly starting to play my old mains. And ever since I started playing my old mains, I've actually been having a lot more fun with the game and actually winning a lot more as well. They're gonna get that. I need to wait till I have my ult. 10 seconds. Oh, Viego is down here. I can... I'm fine with getting their attention down here on me. I'm very mobile, so if they want to try and do stuff with me, they're just going to notice that it's a little hard to get me down. You go stop stud. They still haven't showed mid. Nay, no, now show. Okay. So we just keep pushing. Yeah, they kind of have to defend that, so I can just take this tower. Oh, a little bit of damage to the turret. They're going to come down here now. Get ready to defend it. Yeah, there it is. That will show me, but I'm already out. So I guess right now we go for Axiom. Yeah, Axiom is going to be very helpful here on me. There we go. And we just push this in now. Camille and Ash are bot side, so we just are free to take another wave on top. I don't have my W, guys. Okay, we're going in, I guess. Nice. Ah, he flashes for me. I really like this particular build on Zed with uh, the Conqueror. It feels often, it feels a lot easier to carry on this than the Electrocute uh, Rampage. Only Bear is just a bit broken, I guess. I think it's GG. I don't think they can defend this. Never mind, of course I had to open my mouth. Damn. <laughs> Anti-heal, by the way. Yeah, no, I, know, I know how this Viego feels. Honestly, like, anti-heal feels so bad. I know, it needs to be overhauled. I agree. It's not, it doesn't do what it's advertised to do. It legitimately just does the opposite sometimes. It feels like you're actually healing them. And that is really annoying. To do Drake, guys. Oh, uh, Viego. You have slain an enemy. <laughs> I might actually get a maw. I got their jungler out, so they have no smite. Oh, this is just a free, free Baron. Yeah, like, what? <laughs> I'm alive, bitches. I swear to god, the Hex Drinker saved my ass there. Go, Nessus, go! 
Go dog go Please tell me we actually end this time Thank you. <laughs> the Bruiser Z setup is just really good. Because with the Electrocute setup, it's really easy to miss all of your cues. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I am tired. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that game took a lot out of me. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go relax a little bit and then hop off. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, for the people who are watching on YouTube, there's probably a video on the screen somewhere right now that you can watch. And uh, it might be good. It might be a bad game. I don't know, because I'm not going to post only wins. I will post everything on my journey. So anyways, I shall see you guys next time, which is tomorrow, actually, around 7 p.m. Take care, guys.